Well, that's great. They 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 they, they, they clean up in the, your neighborhood. No, you know our neighborhood. It's weird. I specifically they did okay they did okay in the neighborhood it is a quiet neighborhood it turns out where we used to live closer to the where they went to elementary school was always hopping just Mm -hmm. dense so they still do a lap there we'll take them over there and they do a lap there with some friends and whatever but then we do our neighborhood and it is just quiet in fact one person knocked on my door last night one you had a total of one total of one had a big ball we went full size because we figured listen nobody ever comes down to this part of the thing and so we we're, we're ready to hey, what's the matter Jim? I, prior to your arrival been i went on a big uh, rant about people that do the full size can go fuck themselves let me explain something to you. i know you it sounds like you have a reason for it well, our, ours is simply if you're gonna venture down where we live, it gets a little dark in our uh, part of the street, and there's nothing beyond us. So you would have to sort of peer down the street and go, uh, yeah, we can go knock on that door. Or you go, forget it. There's High efficiency there. is to skip that house and mm-hmm. go somewhere else. So if someone were to come down, they got a full size. But that's one that we handed out. Otherwise, we were just sitting on a mountain of everything. I understand what you're saying. Yep. It's It sort of goes, it sort of breaks the rules that we've all agreed to, that we're going to hand out a nice little piece of candy. We want to see you with your costume. It's a nice little transaction. And then these other assholes are like, hey, come, here, come here, come here, come here. You know, it's like the guy at the graduation party who gives out 200 bucks. And you're like, I got I got 20 bucks from Uncle Jimmy or, or 200 bucks from this guy. I like him more. Right. That's how it goes. Mm-hmm. No fair. So you want to be liked. I want your big candy. desperately to be liked. That's why I'm fixing my teeth. Uh, <laughs> it all makes sense. Uh, by the I've way, gotten taller. I don't know if you noticed. I've gotten taller. You look taller when you walk That's in. That's something I was going for. Uh, you, by the way, beat us uh, by one trick or treater. Oh no, zero. Zero. How? I don't know. Even by mistake, somebody should have come up to our house. <laughs> like I don't. We we as I mentioned earlier, we left the bow the bowl on the. Uh, uh, porch yeah. uh, while we were gone and uh, nothing, not one, not one person. Wow. And I, and I verify that with a ring. That's right. So yes. I, uh, yeah, it's a, it's a shame. It's I don't a, know. It's a shame. I, the, my wife did bring up, Virginia said, you know, maybe next year, because B is getting older, maybe we'll do the thing where we'll, we'll maybe throw up some lights, you know, because we do decorations, but again, where we are, you'd really have to come around. You got to get some bright, to some bright yeah, display. Put up, maybe make some sounds, put up some mm, lights, something yeah, yeah. not scary because it's a, it's a, we have a lot of young kids in our neighborhood, but just something to make it seem worth walking that extra block. Do you think there's a chance that in the neighborhood you're not liked? <laughs> oh, absolutely. <laughs> I, I know I'm he's not. doing all this other stuff? <laughs> <laughs> really? I know I'm not. I, I, I would love to tell you about a small, uh, I'm not going to call it an altercation. It was an uh, interaction. There is, uh, in our neighborhood, uh, they're trying to, <clears throat> they have a, there are a lot of local signs for a, a, a local congressperson to weigh in on uh, some zoning that's being considered for our area. We have one of the signs in our yard. And a group was coming around making a video that is promoting, uh, or, or they're, they're on our side. They're saying, you know, stop this zoning that's happening. And they, they were filming in front of our house. And uh, I was sort of watching from the window. Now, I didn't know what side they were. I, didn't, I knew that it was a video about this zoning thing, but I didn't know at that moment who, what, what anything was. The person from the group who's, uh, I see them kind of looking around and they point at the sign on our yard and he, he starts to walk into our yard and take the sign. Now I, I, I bang on the window and I go, Hey, can I help you? <laughs> My wife and two children vanished, <laughs> gone. Cause we're not, look, we're not a confrontational people necessarily, but, uh, I am the most confrontational of our family mm-hmm. clearly. And the guy sort of puts his hands up and he's like, he says, tries to say, so I said, door. So I go over there, put on my mask. I go to the, this is a couple months ago. I go to the door. I say, what are you doing? He said, oh, I'm sorry. We're, we're with that group that your sign is from. We're making a video. I said, right. Just knock on my door and ask. And he says, uh, right. You know, we'll, we'll find a different sign. I said, no, you can take the sign. That's not the problem. The thing is, that's my yard and my sign. <laughs> And he said, right, no, I know, I, I will find a different sign. I said, you don't have to find another sign. You can take that sign right there. <laughs> oh, I'm God. just saying, knock on my door and let me know you're going to take this. Don't just march across the lawn and start to take my shit. Right. Just tell me. Uh, it's, sorry, sir, it won't happen again. We'll find another sign. <laughs> okay. You can have that one. I don't know why we're still arguing about that. Right. It's a, it's, it was just decorum. Bye. That was, the, uh, that was it. Not an altercation, but I was definitely the old person... 
I've also done the thing where, so you know, somebody's walking their dog, dog poops in the lawn, they keep walking, I'll go, excuse me, open the door. You need a bag? <laughs> Let me get your bag. Uh, no, I, I, I got a bag. Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't have the balls to do that. I get a little frustrated. I want to do it. Definitely the old old man. Yeah. I want to do it. Oh, do I want to do it? Yeah. But I don't. I don't. I, I, I don't know. I... Uh, Look, I've never been in a fight. The only fights I've ever been in, I was in the receiving end of everything. I think I hit back once and it, I paid dearly for it. So I've always been just a, a yammerer. Uh, I kept talking and they would hit me till I stopped talking, and basically. And that fucked up your teeth. And that, that's what happened to my teeth. Uh, so I, I, I don't have a problem talk. But if it, anything ever turned even kind of sniffed at being physical, I'd be like, nope, never mind. Mm -hmm. And it would be gone instantly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I feel very, I'm good at being loud. I'm just not good at uh, anything else. Well, and this new height has to be helping, right? Yes, yeah, more imposing than part of been. what I'm going sure, for. Yeah. Yes, um, stretching it out on the rack. <laughs> 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 to hear the whole conversation, subscribe for free on Apple Podcasts or wherever you get your podcasts, or visit NeverNotFunny.com.